Okay, we got our shutter priority station. This is for action and movement. So we have this little spinner and our awesome little fan. And what we're going to do is show you how to capture movement with shutter speed priority. On your camera, your Lumix camera, you're going to put it on the S for shutter. And let's see, this thing is spinning and we're going to put it on a 60th and we'll capture that. Look at it, it's blurred. So let's say we want to freeze that action. We're going to change our shutter up to 400 and boom, frozen. If we want to blur it on purpose, let's go down to 40. Look at that. So on shutter priority, all you have to do is you set the shutter speed you want to get the motion you want. Camera does the rest of it for you. It's pretty awesome. Okay, are you ready for the aperture priority station? This is where you're going to use A for aperture priority and get some really cool depth of field. Check this out. So we have our beautiful flowers here and we have some flowers in the background as well. So when you take this shot, wow, it's not what it looked like, right? I want that to be out of focus. So let's see, if I change my aperture down to 2.8 and I take that shot, see how pretty and out of focus that is? But if I change it up and let's make this more like... Uh, 14. Look at that. The flower is, let me review. There you go. The flower is more in focus. So you can really control the where your eye goes in the picture by putting that in focus and everything else soft. So aperture is the key to that beautiful depth of field and that pretty bokeh where the lights glow.